Mr. Chairman. Thank you. Senator Tiller, did you want to say something? Thank you, Mr. Chairman. I think I asked a lot of my questions earlier today, but thank you for giving me a second to close. Um, first, I want to thank the members of the committee. I appreciate your cordiality today and how you handled things, even though I know there was a lot of passion. Um, but I do appreciate how you handled yourselves. There were things I learned today. When I came into this room, I'd gotten a lot of questions, just like many of you, from calls from your constituents. And because of some of the things I heard today, I think I'm better prepared to answer some of them. I'll carry you back through just one or two of them. When we heard from the Colonel, and he mentioned about things from Dominion, I'm sure you've gotten a lot, a lot of calls about that as well. And we walked him through, and he got to the end, and he said, if you did a 100% recount or 100% canvas, then I would have to say it would probably remove some of my concerns about a glitch. That's helpful for me. And that was testimony you heard here today. When you heard from Grace Lynn, the student from Georgia, who talked about not being able to, uh, well, going in and hearing that she had already requested an absentee ballot. I know I've heard that a hundred times. I'm sure you've heard it as well. The testimony that we were able to get from her and then thanks to Jennifer, uh, Senator Jordan, Senator Dolezal, and, and others, we were able to show her, no, here's how that actually works. And we were able to help answer her question, which watching that is gonna help me answer questions for my constituents. Those are the things I learned. That's where I was able to grow and I can answer questions from my constituents. But there was one other thing we saw today too. One of our senators already mentioned an Alice in Wonderland moment. That happened for me too today. And that happened when Miss, I believe her name was Miss Pick, played her video. I can't explain that one. I cannot go back with that video and help my constituents understand what was done and why it was done. When I see the table come in at 823, it's got a, a drape all the way over it. I see something happen at 1123 later on. I see folks leaving at 1030. I can't answer that one. That's the one that I'm going to be focused on trying to answer as we move forward. Mr. Chairman, I want to thank you for your help today answering questions that our constituents bring, uh, members of this committee. But I remind you that our work doesn't end today. Thank you, Mr. Chairman.